Hey y'all, welcome back to another one. Today I'm going to be using some candy colors and we're going to do a crawfish pattern on these things. <clears throat> Almost like a fire crawl. The main part of the body is going to be blood red, candy 2.0. Before that we're going to put a little bit of tequila yellow on the belly and the base a little bit. But before that, <clears throat> these are already foiled. But on these, I'm going to hit them with the Quicksilver Chrome. And then I'm going to put the Quicksilver Chrome on the top and the base of these because they're just primer white up there. So we'll do that first and then we'll go to the candy cone. Fish it! Fish it. Fish it. He's fishing it. first quicksilver chrome we're just gonna coat this whole thing might take a couple coats we'll see how it looks after one There's one coat on those. <clears throat> Let me get the bases and the tops of these real quick. That should be good on the Quicksilver Chrome. We'll hit them with a hair dryer, heat set them, and then we'll move on to the candy colors. All right, so on the candy 2.0 colors, you've got candy 2.0, and you've got to use a balancing clear. This is the 4030. That's the one I use with my candies. And it's literally one for one. So one drop, one drop, two drops, two drops. So first thing we're going to do is it's going to start with the tequila yellow. We're doing four baits, so I'm going to do five drops. Actually, you know what? Seven, seven drops. Probably more than I need, but we'll see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna coat most of this bait except for the top in the yellow. Bottom up to the, well, I say half of each bait. So the bottom up to the side of the body line. So we'll get that mixed. In there real good. Yellow is ready to go. So we're gonna hit the base. All the way up to the body line. Almost like a 
gold color there. I might have to mix some more. I don't know if I have enough for these two. So I've got the blood red next up in here. So let's hit the top of these. Right down the body line, we're gonna overlap that yellow a little bit. that are foiled already, they, they turn out really nice with these candy colors. See that pattern in there? That's really good. Now let's go back and hit a second coat of red on these. Brighten it up a lot. set these let them dry for a little bit and then we'll come back and put a crawl pattern on the side of them with some opaque black see y'all in a minute all right so i'm actually gonna put the eyes on first <clears throat> because i want to darken them up so when i put that opaque black in there for the crawl pattern i can darken the eyes up too so i'm gonna go ahead and glue those on Little dab of glue. All right, so I'm ready for the patterns on them. The lipless crankbaits, I'm gonna do like this, almost like a zebra pattern or a tiger pattern on those. And then I'll do a crawfish pattern on the square bills. So we'll hit one of these real quick. I just have the opaque black in the gun. Line it up to where I want it. That 
side. Hit this with the hair dryer, dry it off, flip it over and do the other side. All right, so now I'm gonna work on these square bills and this is the crawl pattern I'm gonna do on it. So let's see. Just gonna go light on it. Come on. Tiny little thing. Alright. I don't know why, for some reason, I've put this on before. If anybody can tell me, drop it in the comments. Opaque black is the only one I get to bubble up like this. I've tried putting reducer in it, and it still just bubbles up. That's the only color that'll do it. So if you know why, let me know. this side. Not to knock the camera over here. Sorry, guys. Try to line them up in the same spots here. on me a little bit. Here comes the fire trucks. I live right down the street from the fire station so I hear that all the time. All right, so got all that squared away. Now on the back side of these square bills, I want to put a line across the back that lines those areas up there. Let's take a piece of cardstock here and bend it over.
Try to get it straight across there, lining those up as possible. There's that one. Let's get y'all back a little bit. got a little heavy right there but I think it'll be all right I don't want to darken the eyes and stuff up on these in the back of these up. Alright. That's it. I think, uh, I don't know. Should we put some specs on there? I think we should put some specs on there. Let's do that. So, got my little brush here. Just gonna dip it down in there, get some black. It's a little test piece first here. Yeah, okay. All right. Let's see if we can't screw this up. crazy rock lobster there we go I like little lobsters I think we'll call that a day on those it turned out pretty sweet and we'll get them dried up and then we'll throw them in some clear it'll be killer Thanks again for watching, guys. If you like the work, if you want to see more, hit subscribe. Hit that notification bell, because when I make another one, y'all can watch it right away. Thanks again. See y'all.